Howdy's howdy, Big Beefy Burger Butter here with a game called, I mess this up every time, Mosalina. Anyway, it's a funny little puzzle platformer game where you, you, you do the thing, you pick up the fruits, you use your tools, and you almost die in the tutorial. And then you get random tools, and then you get a beverage of choice, and then you gotta beat the level. Uh, it's a fun game. I really like it. It is really good. You just pick up the fruit, and then you walk over, and then I have some options that I could use. I could bamboo up there and spam the jump and make it. <laughs> you just gotta use your random tools. Uh, this one sucks. Hold on, I got a plan. Ready? Check this out. Um, it involves impulse. That was the. This, this is what this game is good at doing. Okay, so one, you actually don't need to collect fruits. If they leave the screen, that actually counts as them being collected. So you can, uh, you can actually leave the stage. And um. That encapsulates uh, that perfectly. This game is really good at, it, at getting that feeling of, how did that work? Um, constantly. It is, uh, it's like, I'm like sitting here like, oh yeah, these are some funny physics. <laughs> but yeah, I should explain what some of these tools do as I, as I play this. Um, so that's bamboo. I feel like that's pretty self-explanatory. It makes a little crossable platform. Then we got... Um, mobilize, which is probably going to get me killed here. Uh, it's going to turn physical items, like solid ones, it's going to make them move. Yeah, exactly how I figured that was going to happen. Uh, this tool is hard to use. Um, so what I'm going to try to do is use it. There you go. Uh, and we won't show what camera does just yet, because we didn't get it yet. Yeah, impulse It's probably going to how we're going to be... Doing the stage, honestly. Uh, just blows everything towards you. Like, towards wherever you, uh, you put the impulse. It's a pretty good tool. Um, it's gonna be weird for this. Because we got the bamboo. Bamboo will actually be shorter if it hits a wall first. But we don't really want that to happen. There's a, this is gonna be a this is gonna be a weird option. Okay, here's the plan. I'm gonna bamboo a bridge. Seems pretty normal. Now we're gonna use spear gun and shoot that down. Might as well collect it. You can actually jump on top of fruits to uh, be able to get some uh, some extra jumps in there. Uh, they can shoot down those little those ropes. And we're gonna make a little bridge. And then we're gonna set an impulse jump. That that worked. <laughs> See, that is exactly what I'm talking about. That is not how I wanted that to work, <laughs> but it did work. Um, I like this game. If you can't tell, uh, it's it's that roguelike randomness, but instead it's a uh, it's a little puzzle game, uh, and it rocks. So, um, we're gonna use, I'm gonna use this. This is phaser, it teleports you to whatever solid object this, like, makes contact with. So, like, after it goes through the wall, it'll teleport you. I go through, um, the edges of the map, which can, which will kill you. If you go off the side, in any direction, top, bottom, left, or right, it, you die. I didn't mean to do that, um... So that's what we did there. Um, so here's camera. Camera is definitely going to be what we need to do do here. Uh, camera has the ability to freeze items. It also makes a little photo. Um, which is going to be particularly applicable right here. When I mess the jump. <laughs> it's a little bit of a hard one. Uh, that was unfortunate. That... Those just did that. Um, I don't think I can make this jump. I'm gonna. Th 
I'm gonna try doing this. Uh, that's gun gun. Yeah, I messed up. Uh, if you die while gun gun's out, you actually, um, don't die. Which is pretty good. <laughs> okay, um... Just gonna make sure I don't fall into the hole there, and then I'm just gonna phase her up. And then we win. A few jumps, you get all these random points. Um... I don't know exactly how those all work. Okay, we have a second attempt at this. I want to do it the cool way. Uh, I think we just... Here's the plan. Let's make a little bridge. And then maybe we can... Okay, that didn't work. Nearly... I, I thought they were going to move. Uh, I think we just can't make the jump. We can do it here. Okay, here's here's the plan here. Maybe just like again, we don't actually have to collect this. So we're just gonna let that fall off. I'm gonna try to throw gun gun as far as I can. It's not gonna make it, unfortunately. Uh, but you, you see that thought process there. Um, that should work actually. Okay. That's gonna be it. Just go for it. Oh, I missed. <laughs> Probably if I did a backflip. Um, I, if I had camera, I, I, I did have camera. I just didn't react in time. Would have made this a lot easier. Um, so we messed up. <laughs> uh, this game is pretty nice. Okay. There you go. Uh, now it's doable. And then, uh, we do it. See, I like this game. Boxes are pretty simple. You put a box down. So, uh, when you're on the very last level, you can see at the top, uh, there's nine levels in a set. Uh, it checkmarks, it picks random ones. Uh, it becomes a large level. Which honestly made it easier. Uh, like, this is hilariously easy compared to what I just did. Uh, we might actually... So, there's gonna be a bit of a weird... Where are we going to have to do this? Um, I don't think I'm going to use Impulse, so I'm going to replace it. I don't think I'm going to use Camera here. So I'm just going to Phaser through this wall. And get both of these fruits, and then just go top. And that's the set. And that's really the, the goal of the game, is basically just to, just to do that. Uh, there's another game mode that I don't want to play. I just want to play a couple more random sets of this. Uh, this is just like a little uh, hub you uh, game over thing. Uh, there's literally no point to being here. Uh, they want you to die a horrible death. And then you get new random tools. And then you get your diverge. And then you get your two, three tools for the map. And then you uh, do the same thing basically. But with just different levels, different tools, different everything. This is rocket ship. Uh, when you touch it, or when you first activate it, it goes in the air. Pretty handy. Uh, this level is actually um, deceivingly hard. Um, and I'm gonna go ahead and try it. So here's the plan. Just get that out of here. Pomegranate. Uh, shoots a projectile that explodes. Blasts things away. Pretty good. Um, frog. I guess here's a good example for what can, frog can do. Frog. Can actually pick up fruits for you. He's gonna bounce off, maybe? Okay. And then I'll just probably do this. Uh, so pomegranate, maybe? Nope. Uh, we got butterfly. Butterfly here. Um, teleports you to where the marker is. And spawns a butterfly, and after a certain amount of time, uh, you te get teleported back. Very good tool. Very good for getting some height like that, and then also teleporting forward. Uh, it's my worst enemy yet again. 
And I don't think I can make that jump, so I'm gonna do it like that and use uh, the photo that is particularly useful <laughs> for making little platforms like that. Uh, this is cruel and unusual punishment. Blue rush. Just like move this. I kind of want. Oh, I think I just made this like impossible. Just get that away from me. Um, I need this to hit this. Okay, there's a second way we can do this. You gotta be pulling my chain. There you go. Again, particularly, particularly useful. Uh, by a surprising amount. Um, I need this to move a little bit more to the right. Uh, this is, uh, this is vaporize. It basically just moves solid objects around. Sometimes unsolidifies them and makes them fall. Sometimes makes things that will be falling stop. It's weird. It's definitely a weird tool. You're gonna cause me problems. So this is a bug. He latches on to the first thing he can find. And then we'll never let go of it. Just, thankfully, he is a, a loser. And he smells bad. <laughs> I got it, got, got him, lizard. And that's also a gun right there. That shoots a little explosive cannonball. Uh, that can kill you. Um, this is a ladder. Let's try to not shoot it into a gap and lose it. As you can see, it, it can happen right there. Uh, basically like bamboo, except it extends like this. Don't, don't do this to me. You can't do this to me. Just don't, like, rotate. Okay, there you go. Almost, uh, nightmarish. <laughs> that happened there. But we are, uh, successful in our endeavors. Doing pretty good right now. I, I still don't know 100% how the score works. I think I'm just gonna throw a frog the wrong direction. There you go. Hopefully he'll bounce off the bottom there. That's okay, so we didn't actually need the frog. <laughs> the assessment I'm getting right now. Just don't, like, shoot me as I go up. Thank you. I was gonna, I was gonna, see, nothing's planned. Uh, if you're fast and don't, like, stand still, you get, like, a point, I'm pretty sure is how it's normally worked. You're in a, in a predicament spot. And I'm gonna pull you out of there with an impulse. And then, um, probably just gonna put a ladder down. Uh, ladders float down very slowly for some reason, as they are well known to do. <laughs> Alright, come on. Alright, frog. Just eat that. So frogs, uh, they can also be used as platforms when they hit spikes. So I'm gonna... Sorry, frog friend, but you have to, uh, you have to have your life ended. Just to, just to, just to make sure, you know, we have a little bit of an extra security on that jump. Uh, let's make the frog die. Sorry, your frog friend. And then, uh, we're gonna do one more. We got some new tools here. Quite a few new tools. In including the best one in the game, in my opinion. This one you don't even need a tool to beat. It's just, like, walk forward. And then we get to use, um, the best tool in the game. Uh, we have Claw. Clamp. Hits an item, and then, uh, puts a little thing on it, and, um, you can move that with the arrow keys. It is extremely strong. Now. We're not gonna worry too much about, uh, being funny here, but we have, uh... We have FISH! <laughs> fish is good for climbing. Surprisingly, but it's also just like funny, and then this level's like super easy. Like this, this should not give me any trouble. And then uh, we just like throw like a bomb just to have fun. Bombs are basically pomegranates, but worse. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna do this. That's upgrav. Uh, anything in this little field of gravity will be teleporty uppy. 
Guess that up. If you could imagine, that uh, is pretty useful a lot of the time. Um, one of those times being right here. And then uh, let's go ahead and use this mushroom. This is a bouncer. It's a little trampoline. Uh, funny thing about it, though. This is probably going to cause problems here. Um, they go haywire pretty easily. And I mean haywire. We'll, we'll probably see it at some point, since it's in our rotation. Um, it's definitely gonna happen here. I'm just gonna... Here's the play. Put that, so I can blow this down, and then get both of these easy. And then we're gonna double bouncer. And then we didn't even need our bombs. Wait, no, we used one bomb. And we didn't need our clamps. Trust me, clamps are the best tool in the game. Watch this. Okay, there's a bomb falling from the sky. Uh, that's a random modifier that can happen in the level. Uh, I'm gonna clamp this. So I can move this up. And honestly, just clamp this one too, right? <laughs> Alright, hold on. I don't break my clamps. Okay, I think I've made this, like, needlessly hard. <laughs> uh, it'll work. This is tentacle. We might as well just get, like, everything that can be modified by, uh, using the arrow keys. Please don't, like, kill me, though. There you go. Uh, tentacles, uh, they move up and down when you hit up and down arrow keys. Which is good. Uh, I don't think I can even make this jump. Yeah, no. None of our tools are actually allow us to even make this jump. Like, we can't really, um, shoot anything in the air. Maybe if we, like, if we did this... It'll probably kill us. Yeah, we don't have- we don't actually have the tools to do that. Um... Which just sometimes happens. Uh, I hate these plants a lot. Not a botanist in this game. I forgot that that one in particular was, uh... Thank you, fishies, <laughs> for making, uh, making this level, uh, funny. I like the fish. They do their job well, which is be comedy. So we just made this level, like, possible is essentially what I'm seeing. Probably not gonna use bombs. That is like the easiest place to put, like. So yeah, the the tentacles they do that, and then you can make a little tentacle bridge. Um, and I think this should be easy. Thank you, tentacles, for doing that. Um, now I'm gonna I'm gonna do the the sensible thing. Freeze the tentacles just so they're there, and then we're gonna upgrab right here. This sh okay, as long as I don't get hit by the photo on the way up. I don't want to jump, because I don't want to give myself too much momentum f uh, and jump off the top. There you go. There you go. Uh, and then you look, you got 74 points. Points are meaningless. I'm going to do one more set, because I'm having fun. Uh, and expect more of these, because like... Uh, this is a pretty, this is a, a straight up addicting game. Phaser, go through wall, get the fruit. We don't need anything else. We did get ball, which is a new tool we haven't shown yet. Ball is, um, ball's okay. Uh, I don't really like ball that much. It's another just like base tool. It's good for giving you a jump in the air. Um, but it has... Up gravity like that. I'm just gonna kill a frog just because I wanted to make it die. I wish I didn't need to do. I'm sorry, frog. I'm gonna let you have uh, your moment here. Come on, frog. Let's see how many fruits this one frog can get. Oh, he's got them. He's got them tiny jumps. Oh, but he's gonna get that one. What? Can they only eat one? Is he sated? Is he sated? 
I guess they can only eat one fruit. Um, but yeah, they can eat the fruits. Thank you for eating the fruits. Two happy frogs. I shot a pomegranate before the map started. It's okay. Um, just don't get killed by the bombs falling from the sky. That's a backflip that I didn't try to do intentionally. <laughs> That's gonna happen a lot. Um, you can backflip in this game. They added it to the game and don't know why. But you, um... You, like... You look down, and then you flick the wrong direction and get shot by the guy as you're trying to tutorial the thing. Thanks, turret guy. Uh, you do- you do- you look down? It's- it's so hard to do. Like, genuinely. I should upgrab now. Okay. Okay, my little legs were, like, doing a thing. And then we clamp. Um... Oh, okay, there you go. I didn't I didn't uh, get to jump there. <laughs> I'm just gonna phaser. I think phaser is gonna be the way to it's the way to go. And then um maybe I'll be able to make this jump. There you go, thank you, Tentacle, you got me up there. Alright, uh, so that's not falling down. Okay, so this doesn't fall now. It's supposed to move a little bit, but it's now it's not. Uh, I don't think I can make this jump. I should have thrown a frog down. I think Tentacle might be able to get me up there. Yeah. It's gonna be super easy. With Tentacle! Uh, unless that happens. Which is fine, because we still got to do it. <laughs> I don't know how it didn't attach to that wall. I just shot a pomegranate again. Um, brilliant player. Okay, um... Upgrave. I'm dead. <laughs> Hold on. Okay. <laughs> Don't even worry. Okay, we got... We got the tools to win this one. See? Okay, hold on. Um... Give me, like, a... Like, a platform that I can stand on. Okay, and that is, like, permanently stuck. Uh, that broke off. Uh, because I shot it with the arrow. That is... <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, have a good day. Alright, um... And then we use clamp. Clamp? Uh, good. Ignore that I shot the, uh, the clamp off with the thing. Clamp's gonna win me this one. Watch this. Clamp? Come on. Clamp. And then that's gonna fall, and then I can use it to jumpy, and then I get in the portal, and then we got two levels left. Alright, um, Phaser is gonna win me this one. Check this out. Put that bomb in there. Hit it with the double bomb! Alright, hold on. I made- I made a- made a mistake. <laughs> How do I even get to that with these? Ah, oh. dude, I got this. It's it's gonna be so easy. Just don't like get knocked off. And then uh, we're gonna we're gonna clamp. We're clamping this no matter what. Let's try to move it a little bit. And then um. There you go. Pretty easy. Last stage. Uh, we are in uh, the nightmare zone. So there's one fruit there. This is gonna be challenging. Okay, um, sorry frog. Sorry frog number two. Okay, I died anyway. <laughs> Get those up grabbies. I didn't mean to do that. That's for sure. Okay, realistically, do this.
this is gonna cause more problems. Alright, let's just do this. We have utilized two of our, uh, our tools. I think the best use of a frog is going to try to get me back over here. I, I shouldn't trust this jump. That was my uh, fatal flaw last time. Okay, um, and then we gotta clamp this. Okay. Uh, and then we gotta clamp this fruit. Okay, um, please go the other direction. Thank you. Okay, um... And now here's the problem. I think we can do it like this. Up grab. Okay. Now, here's the problem. This is gonna be this is gonna be the way to do it. Um, I I'm gonna try to clamp one of two items, uh, either the spike ball so I can just lift it the way I'm lifting the other one, or the fruit, and use that as a as a way to get up up up, up on the thing. Um, now I don't like that angle. So we're gonna try to nudge this a bit. That works way better. <laughs> a good game um i like it it's it's funny you get to use the funny tools and then um yeah so if you like this game uh leave a like tell me if you want more because i'm definitely about to record another one after this so regardless of that you're at least getting one more uh subscribe if you haven't join my discord links in the description i'll see you in the next one I'm <laughs> not